Hi, I'm Bulbasaur. And I'm Squirtle. And this is the final episode of Pokemon... Wait! What? Yes, it's a bittersweet day for the both of us, since today is indeed the final episode of Pokemon Talk. What the f***? I wasn't informed of this! We got cancelled? Why? Oh my god, this is a complete disaster! Season 5. What? It's the final episode of Pokemon Talk. Season 5. You know, because it's the season finale. Bulbasaur, you mean to say that you clickbaited our audience? Yeah. <laughs> Pretty funny, right? No, Bulbasaur. No, this is not funny. People take clickbait super seriously on YouTube. You can't just do it as a joke. Oh. Uh, sorry, I didn't realize it was that big of a deal. It is, Bulbasaur, because now we're going to get dislike bombed. What? No. Psh. No. Psh. No. We'll be totally fine, since our lovely, loyal fans will definitely remember to leave a like on the video. Please? Ugh, it might be okay, but only if you apologize and promise never to do it again. All right, all right. I am sorry for clickbaiting, and I promise never to do it again. Unless this video does really well, in which case I'm definitely going to consider it. Ugh, good enough, I guess. Anyways, today's episode is a pretty big one for us. The 50th episode of Pokemon Talk. Well, it's not exactly the 50th Pokemon Talk video that we've posted, but 50 is in the title, so that's what we're focusing on. Last week, we posted the top 50 Pokemon Talk moments as a fun way to look back on the series. So check that video out if you haven't already. Speaking of that, can we talk about how your voice used to be so much deeper than it is now? Well, that's because I hit puberty, Bulbasaur. Doesn't puberty make your voice deeper? Not for Squirtles. But haven't you also been an adult this entire time? Have I? I certainly haven't acted like one. I must say you got me there. But anyways, since those of you guys who did see the top 50 moments really liked it, we decided to do some more reminiscing here in episode 50. So today, we're going to have several special guests. Throughout today's episode, we'll be doing several mini-interviews with past guests that we've had on the show before. Bulbasaur, are you sure about this? We said we didn't want episode 50 to be a clip show, and while it's technically still not, it's Kinda close to that. As I said, people loved last week's clip show, so why not do a bit more of the same? Everyone, please give a warm welcome to our first guest of today's show, and the first guest ever on Pokemon Talk, Blaziken! Ah. Yes. This cannot be good. Hi there, Bulbasaur and Squirtle! I am your biggest fan! I've seen every episode of Pokemon Talk ten times, even the obscure Chairway to Heaven minisode. While we really appreciate that, we don't know you, and you're not supposed to be here. Who let you in? I let myself in. I just popped through one of my ring wormholes. I thought you couldn't travel through your own rings. Only in the movie, which I'd really prefer we did not discuss. That was not a high point in my life. Not a high point in anyone's life, if we're being honest. I love Pokemon Talk so much, so I really wanted episode 50 to be absolutely perfect. And since simply interviewing past guests sounded super boring, HA! Told you! Man, I'm on fire with correctness today. I decided I would make it more interesting. More interesting? <laughs> Sounds like a lot of- Oopa! Sounds like a lot of- Oopa! Sounds like a- Oopa! Oopa! Sounds like a lot of hoopla to make about our plan for the 50th episode, right? <laughs> Wrong! It's gotta be zany and interesting, so I'm gonna make it that way. Have fun, guys! Have fun? Have fun doing what? Going everywhere! What the? Where are we? Not sure. Looks like some kind of flower bed? What? Hoopa? Hoopa, are you here? What the heck did you do this for? Bulbasaur? Squirtle? What are you guys doing here? Oh, hey, it's Trico. Our second ever guest and the first guest to make a return appearance. First appearing in episode two, then reappearing in episode four. You said that really unnaturally. What are you talking about? There's nature all around us. But anyways, we were sent here by Hoopa. What about you? I actually live here. Lots of plants all around. It's quite nice. Oh. 
cool. Do you see now why interviewing past guests would have been super boring? All right, all right, fair enough. But forget about that. What do we do now that Hoopa has just left us... ...in a... bathtub? There is no way this is sanitary. Oh, hey there, guys. Oh. Hey, Waylord. Are we in your house? Yup. Well, you've got a very nice bathroom. Oh, the bathroom's not mine. Just the tub. The tub is... my house. Oh. Well, why isn't there any water in it? Oh, well, I just drained it for its once-a-year cleaning. Oh, well, that's a relief. I was just about to start. Hello. Oh, well, that's fantastic. Uh, is Lapras around? Oh, well, yeah, he's my next-door neighbor. He lives in the toilet. Oh, well, hey, Squirtle, at least be glad we didn't get sent to- Don't jinx it! I don't mean to be rude, but why exactly are you guys here? Well, it's our 50th episode, and a random Hoopa decided to make it more entertaining by teleporting us to random places. I'm sorry about the teleportation struggles, but man, 50 episodes? That is awesome. Sounds like you guys are doing pretty well. Hey, it's hard to believe my episode was almost four years ago. Dang, was it really? Huh, Squirtle, I feel like we might be getting... Old. Well, all right, another warp done. Where are we this time? Huh, smells nice. Is that lavender? Oh, oh no. You okay, bunny? We left the dirty bathtub, so I figured now you'd be- No, 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 this cannot be happening! Hoopa? Hoopa, are you there? Hoopa, please get us out of here immediately! What's the big deal, Squirtle? It looks like we're just in someone's living room. We're hardly in any danger. Well, I suppose someone could think we're trespassing, but I doubt- Bulbasaur, you don't understand! This isn't just some random living room! We're in the living room of my parents' house! So? Your parents are nice. They might even offer us some food or- And they're not expecting anyone! Oh. Oh. Honey, I'm waiting for you. Hi, waiting for you. I'm... Daddy. Hoopa, get, get us out of here right now! Ugh, oh, thank Arcus. I have never felt more relieved in my entire life. Not even after I saved your life when the Mega Raichus attacked? No, of course not. That was just a minor inconvenience. Death would have been a minor inconvenience? Yeah, I just turn into a ghastly, then try to evolve to get my hands back. Not a big deal. I'm not sure how that... Oh, hey, we're back in the studio. Wow, what a relief to finally... Hi, everyone. It's a pleasure to be here in our office today. Hi, guys. Jolteon? You busted into our studio again? No, actually, you've busted into the Evolution Brothers headquarters. Remember in Vaporeon's flashback, how this room looks identical to your set? Wow, you are not exaggerating about that. I swear, it's the same place. Yeah, weird, right? But anyways, what brings you here? Ugh, do we really have to explain what's going on again? All is well, brethren, for I... Ah! Oh, hey, what's the big deal? I didn't sneak up on you this time. I know, but you had some floor tentacles about to grab your nose. Oh, well dang. Thanks, dude. But anyways, I'll handle explaining to Jolteon what's been happening. What? How do you know what's going on? I know all and see all. Remember? Ah, yes. I definitely paid perfect attention to everything you have ever said. Oh, that's really nice of you. But anyways, are you guys having fun on your teleportation adventure? Um, kinda? It's been nice to see some of you guys again, but... We've almost died twice. We did not almost... <laughs> die. Although, now I'm not entirely sure that will be true for... much longer. Does this place look familiar to you? I swear I've seen it somewhere before. Not on our show, but in other media. Same here. I hope I'm wrong, but... Is this... Who has entered my domain? Oh no. I hate to say it, but I think I was right. Squirtle, this is Cerulean Cave. And that voice... was Mewtwo. Who has entered my domain? Well, hey, before we freak out, this may not be that bad. 
It could be one of those Mewtwo's that sees now that the circumstances of one's birth are irrelevant, and it's what you do with the gift of life that- Or it could be like the one that almost drowned Red and his Charizard in Origins. Answer me, or f***ing die! Son of a bisharp. Hi, Mewtwo, uh, I'm Bulbasaur, and this is Squirtle. We are so sorry we intruded onto your home. We were sent here against our will and have no interest in harming you at all. If you just let us be for just a minute or two, we'll likely be teleported out of here before- Do you... work with humans? Uh, no. No, we do not. What are you talking about, Bulbasaur? We work with humans all the time! Well, a human being Michael, but lots of humans watch our show- He's kidding! Haha! <laughs> Funny joke, Squirtle. In reality, we hate humans. They totally suck and smell bad. Dude. What are you doing? Being honest, what are you doing? Using my previous knowledge of Mewtwo's hatred of humans to not get us killed. Uh, but anyways, yes, we hate humans. You are a liar. What? No, that's completely... Ah, crap, how did you know? I can read minds, obviously. Also, I'm standing like two feet away from you and could hear the entire conversation. Dang, really? Most of the time, whispering a few feet away is foolproof. First you intrude upon my home, and then you lie to me, which makes you no better than the humans you worship and obey. So you must be destroyed! You both are pathetically weak. And to think, I was hoping killing you might be a bit of a challenge. How? How are you this strong? Dang it, Bulbasaur, you had to go and clickbait! Now it really will be the final episode of Pokemon Talk, because we're going to die! <laughs> Squirtle, where did you get that? It was just sitting on the ground over there in a pile of sparkling dirt. A Master Ball, just lying there, on the ground. Yeah, right next to a Helix Fossil. Weird, right? Yeah, it is weird, but thank God you found it. We were done for otherwise. What do I do with him now? I don't know, but we need to get rid of it. No way anyone opening that ball would be a good idea. Agreed. Guess we'll just have to wait until Hoopa... ...brings us back. Oh. Hey. We're back at the Evolution Bros headquarters. Nope, you're back in the studio. Aw, oh, thank Argus. Hoopa, if we hadn't just been beaten within an inch of our lives, we would kill you. Wait, what? You sent us to an unsanitary bathtub, to my parents' house uninvited, and then to Cerulean Cave, where Mewtwo almost killed us. The garden and the Evolution Bros place were fine, though. Wait, what was wrong with your parents' house? You do not want to know. Alright, well, I'm sorry about the Mewtwo thing. I genuinely wasn't expecting him to still be there. I was just hoping you'd find some cool stuff in the dirt, though. And hey, it looks like you did! A freaking Master Ball, huh? Those are pretty rare! Yeah, we used it on Mewtwo. Excuse me? Yeah, it was the only way to stop him from killing us. Oh. Oh my. Yeah, would you mind sending this Master Ball to some extremely remote spot on the planet before getting the hell out of our studio? Right. Can do. Sorry about the chaos and stuff, but hey, it was interesting, right? F you. Fair enough. I'm leaving now. But before I do, I love you. Well, I don't know about you, Squirtle, but I am exhausted and very ready to wrap this season up. Same here. But hey, I must say, Hoopa did have a point. The episode was indeed interesting. Fair. And, to be honest, I am looking forward to more craziness. You think we'll make it to episode 100? I freaking hope so. As long as we don't get ourselves killed first. Psh, like anything actually bad could ever happen to us. Ha, <laughs> true. See you guys in season 6. As a thank you for the amazing support I've gotten over on Twitch the last month, I am giving away the ultimate Pokemon prize pack, which includes a Let's Go Pikachu Nintendo Switch and all of these other awesome pieces of Pokemon swag. If you want to enter to win, head to the link down-